Hello friends! Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you haven't been here before. I'm Erin. So today's video is a Wish haul. I know I had said a while ago that I had ordered stuff from Wish, but if you've ordered stuff from Wish before, you know it takes forever to get here. So I ordered this stuff in April sometime and I finally got the last package the other day, so it took about a month to get everything. If you haven't heard of Wish before, it is a website or an app that you can download where they have lots of cheap things, they all come from China, they take forever to get here, but sometimes it's worth it. Um, and I say sometimes because sometimes they send some shady stuff. If you <laughs> go through other people's YouTube videos, like when they order clothes and stuff, you don't quite get what's in the picture. And I think sometimes with some other stuff you don't. I personally have never ordered any type of clothing off of Wish because they are Chinese sizes and I am a large person so I won't fit in half of the clothes and I don't really want to try. Just the truth. I may try sometime but right now I'm just finding too much other useless knickknacks on Wish that I want so look forward in the future to seeing some more Wish hauls because I definitely will be buying more stuff from there that I probably don't need but I want. So for today's haul I have about 10 items I think and I will of course put a screenshot and let you know how much I paid for it. I don't remember what shipping prices I had, I forgot to screenshot all of that when I bought them. So I'll just give you the price that I paid for it. That's the thing with Wish if you haven't ordered off of Wish before is that you have to pay shipping for each individual item which is what can rack up in the end. For these 10 items I paid less than $30. I want to say I paid $25 and that includes the shipping that came with them. Sometimes you can find stuff that's free on Wish but you have to pay for the shipping of course. So that's the way that works. I know there's another app called Joom. I've been kind of hesitant to try that but it's just like Wish except for you don't have to pay shipping on items. So I might check that out sometime too so look forward to that video. Alright let's get into what I got. Most of the stuff that I ordered was jewelry and Harry Potter based believe it or not. Um, there's a few other random things in there that I got. That's what will happen when you drink and wish. You buy stuff that you probably don't need but you decided you wanted so that's what I did. But anyway let's get to it. Here is the container of goodies that I will be opening so it's all little stuff. Probably should go on Wish and order some kind of cute container to hold things that I need to open in because these being scattered all over my counter in my kitchen probably is not the best place for them. Just saying. Alright, let's get to it for real this time. Okay, so first thing is this little tiny thing. And sometimes on your Wish labels they will give you the description and this says it's a necklace. So let's see which necklace it is my handy dandy scissors. Alright, woo! I was excited about this one. It's in a little teeny tiny package and like I said most of this stuff is kind of Harry Potter themed because I've been on a Harry Potter pick. So I got some Harry Potter jewelry and some other stuff so I'm kind of excited to share it with y'all. First thing I will say is that the chain on this is pretty dang cheap looking but I still like it and I might just get a better chain for it. So what I got it is silver and it is a Deathly Hollows necklace. So it's really pretty. Like I said the chain is kind of chintzy looking but I still like it. I think it'll be a good length on. Um, let me try it. Alright so as you can see it's a deep decent length. I actually really like it. Like I said the, the chain looks kind of chintzy so might have to change that but all in all I don't hate it. It's not bad. Let's see how much I paid for it. Alright so I like to say the silly names that they put on the titles for this. So this necklace was labeled Hot Sale Fashion Lovely Film Movie Harry Potter Deathly Hollows Metal Necklace Pendant Jewelry Gifts. Sorry for the bump in the camera. Dixie just has arrived. She's announcing that she's here. And I paid a dollar for this plus whatever shipping was. I don't think it was any more than a dollar. So we'll say I paid two dollars in total. 
All right, on to the next thing. Okay, next thing is this. Um, when this came in, I saw the description. And I was like, what the hell did I order? Um, the description on here is Carrot Muppet. I know what it is, though. Um, I did buy some stuff for Ollie and Dixie, of course, because I am a crazy dog lady. So let's open this up. Let's see what a Carrot Muppet is. Comes with two. And they squeak! Look how cute these are! So obviously if you have a bigger dog, these probably aren't gonna be for you. <laughs> these are the cutest things. I feel like I need to order him and her more. It's convenient that there's two. They're actually made out of some good quality material for coming from China. They're very soft. Um, I'm sure that they will be destroyed <laughs> quickly, however, but that's the way most dogs go. But they're definitely cute. They have little squeakers, like I said. And, I don't know, they're cute. Like I said, they're just really soft. They have like the little carrot thing up here. And look at their little faces. Look how cute. I love it. Alright, so the Carrot Muppets, which I will forever call them that, because now I have Muppets in my house, were under Funny Dog Toys, Puppy, Pet Supplies, Vegetables, Carrot Plush, Sound, Squeaky, Chew, Squeaker. And I do remember when I was looking at these, the store had like a whole bunch of different ones. So I'll probably order a different kind. I just thought it was cute that you get two. However, I will say in the picture there is three pictured. So I don't know if I just got ripped off or I got lucky that I got two. The world may never know. And in any event, I these were free. So I just paid shipping, whatever that was. And I don't think it would have been more than $2. Because I don't think I would have paid more than $2 for them. But they're super cute. I really like them. And like I said, I'll probably get some more and this product was verified by Wish as was this necklace. I did forget to mention that. I'm kind of surprised Ollie didn't come running. Meep meep meep. He probably knows what I have in store for him in a few minutes. Next we have this. The description is not on this one I don't think. Oh jewelry. Like I said, mostly jewelry, mostly Harry Potter. But I did get some other stuff. I just don't remember really and I'm actually trying not to look through my list to spoil my own surprise. It's kind of like Christmas when you get wish stuff. <gasps> oh! This is also Harry Potter themed. It is a bracelet. I had originally ordered this in a different color but they didn't have it in that color so they just refunded me my money. So I went ahead and ordered this one. I have a little Deathly Hollows theme going on. So this is a bracelet, it's one of those cool bracelets that has like different things but the clasp on it is like this. So this has, so it's got a snitch on it, I don't, well obviously it's not a golden snitch but then I'm pretty sure that that's what this is supposed to be. And then it has the Deathly Hollows symbol on the inside and then down here on the bottom I don't know if you can see it too well, those are two cute little owls. So I thought that this was going to be one of those things that you tie on, but it's not. You clip it on. So I might have to wait to wear this to when I get some assistance to put it on. So it's super cute. I have it on kind of loose because I need a second person to help me if I'm going to do it any tighter than this. But, but as you can see, it's super cute. I really like it. So for those wondering, it is fake leather, but it's actually pretty good quality leather. And I actually really like it. It's super cute. I think it'll be cuter when it's tighter. But like I said, I can't do it myself. I need help, not have help home right now. So I'm just kind of holding it like that so you can see what it looks like a little bit tighter. Super cute. Really like it. So this one is Gift Owl Harry Potter Deathly Hallow Snitch Wing Bracelet Black Woven Leather. That's not really leather. And they had different colors for this one too. The one I wanted was super cute. The braided parts were white and the other ones were like a navy blue. 
and I really liked it, but they don't have it anymore. So I went with the black one because, as you can tell, black is kind of my motif. So this one was a dollar. Okie doke. Next one, another small one, probably more jewelry is my guess. This bracelet. We'll see which bracelet this is. Oh, so this one is kind of similar to the last one bracelet I got, which is kind of why I wanted the Harry Potter one in a different color, but I didn't like the other colors they had. So I went with black since they didn't have the blue and white one. But this is super cute. I really like this. It's another bracelet that's like the other one. This one, the chain isn't as long. It's the same thing, the black fake leather. Let's spread these out a little. If you look, it has a little anchor on one, two little swallows on this one, a treble clef in the middle, and then an infinity sign. I thought this was super cute. And I guess it is a little different. It only has the one braided one instead of two. You know, for the price you pay for this stuff, it's not bad. And again, I don't really have anybody to help me put the stuff on. So it's gonna be a little loose. I need one of those things. I know there's like a bracelet helper. It's like one of those as seen on TV. Ooh, I really like this. This is super cute. Super, super cute. I love it. It's super cute. Although you can't really see the little anchor because the birdies are in the way. Oh well. Okie dokie. And this was listed as one pieces antique silver swallows ankle rario musical note? Infinity charm bracelet. I don't know what a rario musical note is, but that's definitely a treble clef for those following at home. And this that one was free, so I just paid shipping for it. This next one had me a little confused because it says home decor and I don't remember ordering any home decor, but who knows? I was half in the bag when I ordered this stuff. So we shall see what this is. Oh, oh, oh I'm an idiot. I <laughs> can't really believe I ordered this, but I do believe I've ordered it because I've been eyeing these for a little while. They're glow in the dark stars. You could get them in all different colors. I think I got them in green or yellow. I can't remember. So, when I was little, I used to have these all over my ceiling. And to be honest with you, I have no idea where I'm gonna put these. Maybe I'll slap them on the wall behind me. A little artwork. They come with the little stickers to stick them on there too, um, which I'm sure will rip paint right off the wall, so. I might go get the stuff that won't rip the paint off the wall, but as you can see, but as you can see, those are the little sticker thingies that come with it. It's just, they're a lot smaller than they looked in the thing, but there's a whole bunch of these little glow-in-the-dark stars. But there's a lot in this bag. I thought, maybe because I thought they were going to be bigger, I didn't think there would be as much, but there are a ton in here. Look at all these stars. What am I going to do? I don't know why I bought this. Well, well, what are you gonna do? I'll put them on the wall or something. I'll make a constellation. Speaking of which, I think I have something else that's astronomy-like coming up. I have no idea what I paid for these, so let's find out what I did. Had I read the whole description, I would have known that I wasn't getting like 15, that I was getting a whole bunch. But you'll see in the screenshot that these definitely look like they were gonna be all different sizes, and they're not. They're just the little ones, but that's okay. And what it says is it's one set slash 100 pieces, kids, bedroom, beautiful, fluorescent, glow-in-the-dark stars, wall stickers, home decor, fashion bedroom. And I paid a dollar for them. Well worth the dollar, I'm sure. Our air conditioning broke yesterday. It's fixed now, but I'm kind of a hot mess because of it, because I was waiting for the AC guy to come. But now we're back in business. You can't be in North Carolina and not have air conditioning. It sucks. Trust me, when the hurricanes roll through and the power goes out, it is my worst nightmare. Especially when it gets hot out. Oh, so speaking of constellations, that is so funny. So this one came with a weird little thing. Must be the name of their, their um, 
store and they're asking for a five star review. It has a little comic on it. Wukong, our mission is to deliver this item to the buyer. It will be a hard and long trip. Are you all right? Yes, the item is fine. Here's your item. Thank you so much. Can you give us feedback? Of course. Five star. Journey to the West, known simply as Monkey, is one of the four great classical novels of Chinese literature. This fantasy presents the adventures of a Buddhist monk who travels to India in search of Buddhist search of Buddhist sutras with his three protectors, Sun Wukong. I'm not even going to pretend to say the other two. They went through all difficulties and hazards, finally retrieved the Buddhist sutras successfully. Many years later, and then it has the little thing. And it says, Dear valued customer, thank you for your purchase. It's our pleasure to do business with you. The item has been sent with care. We hope you are satisfied with our service. Leave us positive feedback with five star DSRs in all categories, which is a huge motivation for us to be a better seller. We are honest seller and do our best to serve you. So if you have any concerns, please don't hesitate to contact us for a solution, and we'll do our best to help. Look forward to serving you again in the near future. Yours, you, yours sincerely. It's actually kind of cute. Look. Little comic. Little letter. First I thought it was some kind of biblical thing, but not so much. Anyway, this is my astrological sign in necklace form. Look how cute. The chain on this one is definitely a little bit better. It looks a little bit more delicate. And this is just it in its shiny package. I'll take it out of here. So, for those of you wondering at home what my astrological sign is, I am a Pisces. So this is the constellation for Pisces. There you go, constellation for Pisces. You can see my Pisces tattoo on my arm. Let's switch necklaces here because I want to try this one on. I like the chain on this other one. Um, this constellation one better than the Deathly Hollows one for sure. Um, it's a little more bah, bah. It's a little more dainty and delicate. So this one is a little bit shorter in length, but it is cute. Look at that. Look how pretty. I love it. So like I said, the chain is definitely a little bit more delicate looking and not so flimsy. So that's exciting. Okay. So this was listed under 12 constellations. Taurus, Gemini, Leo, Pisces, Sagittarius. Necklace birthday gift. I guess if you're like a Virgo or an Aries, you're just sh shit out of luck, according to them. Anyway, this was free. I only paid shipping for it. Up next, it says it's some bracelets. I think this is the last thing of jewelry that should be in here. And it is different than the other one. Woo! So there are three of them, and I remember ordering these. These are anklets, and they have little turtles on them. There's one with black, and I can't tell. Oh, black, white, and like a teal color. Sorry, I was just trying to figure out how this all works. Oh, they're super cute. So look how cute. This is the blue one. Little sea turtles, I love them. And you'll see in the screenshot that they're supposed to be like stacked on top of each other, which I think is super cute. I like the the cordage that they're made out of. This is the white one. And then this is the black one, which I've kind of stretched out. And there's the black one. So they're super cute. You get three of them. And like I said, you'll see in the screenshot that I'll show you that you're supposed to stack them like one on top of each other as an anklet. I mean, I guess if you get this for like a younger person, like your kid or whatever, you could have them use it as like friendship bracelets or something like that. I know me and my friends, when I was little, we had friendship bracelets, so these would kind of be perfect for that. And you can use them on your wrist or on your ankle. I got them specifically to be like summer anklets. So those were listed as Bohemian, Retro, Charm, Carved, Turtle Pendant, Ankle Bracelets, Set, Handwork, Weaving, Leather, Women, Trendy Bracelets, Ankle, Summer, Beach, Accessories, Gift. And they were free. I just paid shipping for them. Alright, so next thing I'm very excited about, because I kind of know what it is, because I can feel it in the package. 
I never had one of these when I was little, like this specific one. I had Nano Pets. I don't think I had a Tamagotchi, but I could be wrong. My mom would probably yell at me. Maybe I did have a Tamagotchi. I honestly, I don't remember. But anyway, I got a Tamagotchi. It's called Tamagotchi Connection. A little bit hard to see in the packaging. I'll take it out in a second. I just wanted to show you what the packaging looks like. It comes with destructions as well. I got the pink and orange one. I don't think you got to pick which one color you got. Comes with the little chain. I have no idea how this works anymore, but I actually have been eyeing this for a while. So we don't know if there's a difference between a Tamagotchi connection and a regular Tamagotchi. I don't even know if they make Tamagotchi anymore. This is a little bit more in depth than what I remember Tamagotchi being. This one you get to pick from 49 pets to choose which one to breed. My camera battery's dying or else I would show it working. Here it is out of the package. Super cute. Pink and orange. Let's see if this baby works. Oh, so you get to pick pets. See, Tamagotchi was just a weird thing. So this you must just get to pick pets. Oh, you can pick from a chicken, a panda, a bunny, a whale, a lion, a seahorse. I like that one. Now I have to set the time. I don't even know what time it is. Oh, this is military time. Crap sticks. Anyway, I'll figure this out later because my camera battery is being angry with me and I really shouldn't be farting around. You can do a shrimp? <gasps> this thing is so cool. A sheep. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is either. Okay, there's some weird looking little people on here you can raise. A dog, a frog, a fish. Okay, I gotta put this away or yeah. I'll let you know how it goes in a different video. This was labeled as Hot Sale 80s, 90s, Nostalgic Toy, Tamagotchi, 49 Pets in One, Virtual Pet Cyber Pet Toy Brave Heart LI. And I paid a dollar for that. Definitely weren't a dollar when I was little. Okay, so I saved the two best things for last and hopefully my camera doesn't die. Harry Potter themed. Okay, so I don't really know. I guess I'm gonna have to stick my hand in here. I got Harry Potter socks. So the one sock says, Master has given Dobby a sock and then the other one says Dobby is free. I saw these and I had to have them. I will say that they are good quality look. They're like ankle socks. I think they would fit anybody with a normal shoe size. If you have monster feet, probably not for you. Let me put these correctly so you can read them. Look how cute. Master has given Dobby a sock. Dobby is free. So like I said, these are definitely good quality. I put them on my feet, even though I don't need to be wearing socks right now because it's hot. Like I said, they're definitely made of good quality stuff. Um, they're going to be warm socks, that's for sure. But I love them. Yay! And you'll see what they look like on feet in the screenshot. So let's see what this one was listed under. I was just looking at the listing, and you can get these in three different colors. I got them in black, but you can also get them in gray with black writing and white with black writing. And these were listed as... New fashion master has given Dobby a socks. HP Dobby is free sock comfortable cotton socks. And I only paid a dollar plus shipping for these. I will say if these were in the store, these would probably be like five bucks for the pair. So I'm pretty damn pleased with it. And I also lied. I guess I have bought clothes off of Wish now. Okay. So I know what's in this last one. And I've been waiting for it to get here. Oliver is going to hate me. This is the biggest one. Open this bad boy up. I just called him in here. He came in and saw the mess on the floor and turned around and walked right back out. So he probably knows that I'm up to some kind of shenanigans since he's been in the last couple videos where I've done hauls. These are so freaking cute. I think they might be too big for him though. They're adjustable. I got him! Doggles! The circles that you see in the middle are the, my ring light. These are the cutest things. They are doggy sunglasses. Let me tighten these bad boys up. Go find them. <laughs> okay, so my camera battery died, but now I'm back. And back to the cutest things ever. 
these little doggos. Look how freaking cute they are. While my camera was dead, I took a picture of Ollie with them on, but let me go get my live model so y'all can see. So, I will say, little turd does not like these, but he's very tolerant. I was a little confused as to what was going on with these straps. Let's see if I can do this without dropping the dog. This little one here goes underneath their chin and this goes behind their head. He's very interested in this. Is this for you? It's for you, right? Can we show people what your doggles look like? And then I'll give you those, okay? Let's show people. Let's show everybody everybody. And honestly, I might have these a little tight on him, so I'll have to fix it. Look at this guy! You okay? Look at his face with these doggles on. And he's the cutest, handsome man in the world. <laughs> I can't, I love it. He hates them. But like I said, he's pretty dang tolerant. He'll only have to wear them for pictures. And for this, I won't make him wear them forever. Okay, let me take these off. Good boy. He said, good boy. Here. See? No worse for the wear. All is right in his world now. He has his toys. He's happy. Alright guys, that's it for this video for today. I hope you liked it. If you did, go ahead and give me a big thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. And if you want to be notified when I post new videos, which is usually every week, go ahead and hit the little bell next to the subscribe button so you are notified when I make new posts. Alright guys, I'll see you next time. Bye!